stolen from the British Museum. Treasures of gold like these from as far back as ancient Greece and Roman times slowly disappeared from its collection over decades. We were the victims of an inside job by someone, uh, we believe, who over a long period of time was stealing from the museum and who the museum had put trust in. Uh, and obviously there are lots of lessons to be learnt as a result of that. Uh, the member of staff has been dismissed by us. A police investigation into the theft is ongoing, but speaking publicly for the first time in front of a select committee in Parliament, the bosses of the museum confirmed that some items have now been recovered. The current situation is that there are about 350 which are in the process of being returned, and uh, our current estimate is that about 2,000 objects have been stolen. These 2,000 objects were really known only to one person, and that person decided to take advantage of that. But these images show only the type of treasures that were stolen and not the exact ones. The British Museum's problem is that it has a lot of stuff. At the last count, eight million artifacts and three quarters of those six million items aren't properly catalogued. Some stolen pieces reportedly found their way onto eBay. Do you think they'll get all their stuff back? So the worry here is that the people who have ended up with these items simply don't recognise their worth and they will be lost forever. They need to have wraparound security measures to not only know what they have, but to know that it hasn't been taken or to sound the alarm very quickly if there's any doubt that the items are not where they should be. But there's also accusations of a cover-up. Two years ago, the museum was warned about the thefts and took no action. When in 2021 the museum receives an email from a reputable antiquarian dealer who says things are being stolen, they're for sale, I think I've bought them and by the way identifies an individual as the person who he believes is responsible, why the museum didn't do better in using that piece of information. The museum is now cataloguing all its items but says it will take at least five years. And once recovered, there's even a plan to exhibit a collection of the stolen artefacts. Rags Martel, ITV News, at the British Museum.